The student section was packed this weekend as the Bears took on southeastern Louisiana for homecoming, defeating them 21-16. Senior safety Bobby Watkins was able to seal the deal with an interception. Guns, a controversial topic in the United States. The Second Amendment states that all Americans should have the right to bear arms. But is it time to make amendments to these gun laws? Welcome to this week's edition of All Access with Coach Steve Campbell and host Michael Deere. The Bears for their home opener defeated Abilene Christian 42-14 on the stripes. And you had three conference wins at home, now you're on the road for a stretch of matches. How do you prepare mentally for that? Uh, we the Bears travelled down to a wet Texas this weekend as they took on the Lamar Cardinals, defeating them 35-17. The story of the night, the offensive line had their best game yet, with senior running back Blake Beasley scoring a single game rushing record. The UCA Sugar Bears have been waiting all day for this game. This is the fourth game of the day and the final game. I got a chance to go in the locker room earlier and speak to Coach Jones and the girls, and Coach Jones told the girls that this is it, it's finally here. I want everyone to leave all the fuel in their tank on the court. There's no going back now. They've got three seniors on this team that they want to send off. With a ring. The UCA football team travelled to Northwestern State this weekend as they took on the Northwestern State Demons. The Bears were able to defeat the Demons 49-21, but the story of the night was starting quarterback Taylor Reed went down early in the first half, but luckily for the Bears, backup quarterback Hayden Hildebrandt was able to step up. I got a chance to talk to head coach Jenny Jones before the game here today and she said the major thing that's going to be tough for the Bears here tonight is that this Lady Lions team has three attackers and they always have a setter up back. So they're going to have to continually be there and be ready to defend if they want to be in the game here tonight. The Blue Jays are hosting the Kansas City Royals as we speak. The Royals are looking to win the first three games of this series. And tonight, the Cubs look to avoid a sweep at the hands of the New York Mets. Cubs fans are still hoping that the prediction in Back to the Future 2 holds true, but chances are looking bleak for the Cubs. That game starts at 7.07 .07 on TBS. Imagine your worst fear coming true. A complete violation of trust. Bride trafficking is one of the most inhumane violations to human rights there is. Pyung Nung, a native of Kachin, Burma, came to UCA to tell her story. So that Chris, it's senior night here for Heather Snaz, Amy South and Corey Hunt. So we know it's going to be an emotional game for those three as they play their last game in the Prince Center.